so this is swimsuit of the day today is on wednesday it does have a cover up although i'll be wearing a dress and then i go first of all to my lindy town and then i'll come to swim i'm also thinking to first of all go to the beach yani i'm confused oh. so i'm wearing this dress over the swimsuit this is how it looks at the back yeah, and then go eat, come back, take a dip, go to the beach, you name it. I'm here for holiday. So I ended up getting this chicken shawarma and a glass of juice and I took away some mishkaki and three sauces which were yum um, so the total that I used was so guys the means of transport here is either tuk-tuk or bikes and please begin after I ate I decided to go to the beach and I got a beach boy who was going to show me around and by the way guys fun fact these people know Italian more than they know English was <laughs> So he was showing me Naomi Campbell's villa, even as a pastoria jabba. But anyways, uh, he said that it's on top of a coral reef, Tirol, and uh, Yani, this house just goes up. It cannot even submerge. Ish, how wonderful! I mean, that's our task. Yeah. <laughs> And it was at this point I thought my phone is gonna go. And so shortly after that I decided to enjoy the water and uh, just to take a deep fill the ocean water, the salty water, but not swim. I don't really have the courage of swimming in the ocean. I'm not willing to fight with all that water. I mean, can I survive honestly? Can I? Can I? Day two, today's swimsuit, very sandless. <laughs> I'm going to be wearing this short. Let me do that and then show you. Here are the pictures since the housekeeper came in. So today itinerary was um, going down to the Golden Beach. Um, this other side is the Silver Sands Beach, I guess, if I'm not wrong. And yeah, so um, that area over there, that's the boat's garage. out here pretending that I'm from fishing wall right. yeah she don't come from fishing <laughs>
the views up here wow just wow they're just breathtaking and the ocean the waves the sounds i mean you could just meditate over here but um if you're afraid of heights and you're not a good swimmer i cannot recommend because you know the drill you might um that kind of voice of telling you to jump over can come over you and please be careful and then i got to see the titanic you guys <laughs> Doo -doo -doo -doo. but oh well these are boats that um they crashed and uh the owners don't want them to like be removed so most of the time they just like sink and um they're not the only boats and uh you're wondering why people from there they will not uh remove them because these are properties by the owner because the owner can decide uh to come and take them as scrap metal so i came to realize that people here in malindi they're not thieves now getting into the fisherman's village so um this village doesn't have any lights and um i think this can be a really cool getaway where you just unplug <laughs> so i am now being shown how um natural wine comes from the palm tree and yeah and you know the vibes i had to test because why not <laughs> Well, if there are things that I enjoyed the most and Loki addicted to, was this my Hi guys, Bida Creek. Yeah, the mangrove trees. You may some apply to the drink both sweet and salty water. What that means? Why sweet? See, not quite salty. Now you're getting into stinky materials. The mangrove what story? <laughs> so guys, now this is the boardwalk in Mida Creek well which is very unnecessary and high key very unkempt they should use the money that uh, they are getting from this to um like at least what again is easy for you to say and then after that and then uh no driven you gonna try this twinky where okay guys <laughs> I was struggling. I was struggling. I was like, I am an irudi. I get to call me must, but I made it through.
Let's hurry up with them before the housekeeping stuff comes. So this is what I'll be wearing. Well, it's not quite short, but it's pretty cute. I love it. This little red romper. So let me apply sunscreen to the place too. The place that can be seen. I have nobody to apply me at the back area, but we we'll manage. I've come over here outside to do some reading. So this is my view, the garden view. I'll be sitting over here with water, of course. Yeah. I was done with the reading after two minutes, I guess. And then I decided to go get some lunch. And then in one way or the other, I found myself in Watamu. <laughs> And guys, honestly, Watamu is so beautiful. The beaches, everything, it's just so clean. And yeah, so how to get to Watamu from Malindi? Uh, so you just uh, get Ibanda uh, Buddha or Anduzi or a tuk tuk and just tell them to take you to the stage, stage Watamu. And then you pay either 80 shillings or 100 bob. But most of the time, it's 100 bob. And then loop the last stage is the apo kwenye kuna petrol station hapo ndo unashukia alafu tuna una nikupanda ama kushuka kwa beach wherever yep Wait guys, it would just enjoy the views because the hotel while telling the deco was decoring, the sun was sunning, the sand was sunning. I I mean Yani like you guys God is a creator. Like when I was standing over there I was in awe like I still remember that feeling. I was like, wow, 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 oh, and sunsets. Day four swimsuits. Looking cool. really good, yes. I'm in the field of dandelions. So today, I just wanna relax. Um, today is my last night and also I just want to sleep, relax, sleep, all of that and yeah, not unless there's something that comes up. And I'll take you guys with me, okay? So I'm having some Sprite and... <laughs> I'm going to have some Sprite. 
ukukoste kutanionesha i keep the things that i've eaten Just editing and then later on I'll be out wearing a very cute maxi dress. By the way guys, like for day, put um, aside a thousand bob or 1500 for food. So drink of choice as I was heading to Mombasa since I decided to go with the SGR, which is two hours away. Hey, Nyali Beach, do not recommend. <laughs> My departure time arrived and yay! So guys, um, you go print your tickets and that's it. Back home!